play the Red Sox in March to October, and we're going to get a little revenge. Oh, here we go. Let's relax. So let's check in with our field reporter, Heidi Watney, who spoke earlier with some players from both sides about what it means for them to be playing in the World Series. Heidi? Matt, playing in the World Series is every player's dream, and just about everyone I talked to echoed that sentiment. One guy told me, I almost can't believe I'm here. I've worked my whole life to get to this moment, but I wasn't Let's sure it would revenge. actually happen. Well, it is happening, but a formidable Let's opponent stands in their way, not to mention the nerves and pressure that comes with playing on the sport's biggest stage. Next up for the Red Sox, Mookie Betts. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Swung on and missed, it's 0-1. Swing and a miss, it's 0-2. Now on 0-2, I don't think we're going to see any more hittable fastballs. If we see one at all, it'll probably be extended out of the zone, or at least that'll be the extent. So he sets him down, swinging. Mookie Betts goes down for the first out in the fifth inning. And a high strike to begin the at-bat, it's 0-1. Yeah, I'm shocked he let that first pitch go right there. High fastball, yeah, right. but usually those ones travel the furthest. Behind 0-2 now. A little bit off the outside. It's 1-2. and two. I like that they went away with that pitch right there. They really tried to do oh, right. that previous cool. pitch. So he was probably what we call inside conscious. He didn't get a strike there, but I'm guessing he was looking for another ball in. There's the fastball that gets the lower part of the zone called for a strike. A swinging strike, and now it's 0-2. This is why this guy is so effective. He's able to pound the zone, get ahead in the count, and now he has so many options to go to. I really couldn't tell you. It's a flip of the coin as to what he's going to throw right here. And he's got himself another one as he picks up strikeout number nine. Oh, he's pitching in Digging no in next is Daniel Castro. Go. Okay, let's bring Max Muncy in. Over one. Your attention, Max please. Muncy will get a shot Muncy here as a pinch hitter. Number 13. Max Muncy. And he got him out in front uh, that time. Saying. Strike one. Yeah. That's taken. Now it's 0-2. So back-to-back -back sliders for strikes. Does he come back with yet another? Normally not a good pitching plan to throw the same hitter, the same pitch three times in a row. But both of those sliders back-to-back -back were so good, I might just go ahead and try to throw another one. Jeez, I didn't well want to Well out in that. front of the breaking ball there for a strike. Throw on to first is in time to get him. So that'll go down as Go's a strikeout and a two-to-three put out for out number there. one. Good job. And he popped Is that going to get in? Bogarts, ranging into oh. the outfield. He's got it. A nice play there. Two away. Back to the top of the order now. And that'll bring up the third baseman, Justin Turner. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Hard ground Jeez. ball to third. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. And a great job to stick okay. with it. As he's Two aces. So digging in now, Steve Pierce. He set to lead us off in the sixth inning. The first we're moving through the middle of this ball game right now. They want to get things going. How about trying to get some base runners on or at least get a base hit? They don't have any hits going into this part of the game. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Fouled away. And he struck him out. The tenth victim set down on strikes thus far. In now, Sandy Leone comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. And this is popped up near second base. And there's out number two. Now to the plate is the Red Sox pitcher, Chris Sale. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Fouled off. Red Sox still looking for their first hit here. Okay. 
Zero. A swinging strike, and now it's 0-2. This is what fires me up right here. You don't get a chance to see this every day of the week. You got the reigning Cy Young Award winner squaring off against the reigning MVP. That's why you pay the price of admission. Oh, and he struck him out. So it might be. Next up for Los Angeles, Chris Taylor. He looked to bounce well, back doctor. after striking out well, his Taylor last time up. This game is Fred. rolling right along as we go he ball. goes down and gets this fastball and go takes ball. it high in the air to deep straightaway center. Oh, and man. he's going to have room to put this one away, and that's the first out. Here's now, Corey Seager, third that trip to the plate for him here Corey. tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. Seager. Oh, the wind's blowing in. That's why it wasn't out. Now, a bouncing ball hit to Pedroia wow. at second. Throw in time. Oh. First for out number two. Oh, yeah. So that'll bring in the National League rookie Cody home run record holder, Cody, Cody Bellinger. It was Bellinger. a walk in his last trip into the corner and slicing foul. No runs, two hits, one error in the ball game for the Dodgers to this point. High and deep down the left field line. And that will end up a foul ball. Lifted the other way down the left get field down. line. Get down, there we go. And that'll get down for a there base we hit. Go. And now it'll kick around in the corner. And he will pull into second with a two-out double. Next for the Dodgers, Kike Hernandez. Now run in scoring right position with two guns. Kike Hernandez. Here's the first pitch to him. Lifted in the air to center. Oh, man. Waiting on it is Benintendi. He hauls it in, and the potential go-ahead run will not. Shoot. So the Red Sox lineup turns over and to the plate, Andrew Benintendi. He'll be the one to start things here against Clayton Kershaw. Back to work now is Kershaw as he jumps ahead of the leadoff man, nothing in one. That misses wide, one ball and one strike. He's going to have to make adjustment on that slider away. He can't just make it a non-competitive pitch and allow these guys to take. He's got to start that a little bit more over the middle of the plate to get that swing and miss on the outer half. Neither guy willing to give in, and the ad battle continue. Uh, and a slider runs away from him there, and the count levels at two and two. Well, one thing about him, he's an absolute grinder at the go. plate. You can pretty much count on him battling at the plate every chance he gets. And he'll stay with it here as he puts the squeeze on it for out number one. Now back. Okay. One that away, and here's the 2008 Dustin. AL MVP, Dustin Pedroia. Out in front of it, strike one. The wind up and the 0 1. Line drive. Oh, the there goes the no hitter. And that's a base hit. So the no hit bid ends here in the seventh. Shoot. Okay. Here's J.D. Martinez, his lifetime numbers against Kershaw. He's a 375 hitter. He also has one home run. Skied down the left field line. Hernandez giving chase. He gets there, and that's the second out. So it's a runner at first with two men out. And up next, one of the terrific talents in the game, Mookie Betts. A big roundhouse curveball in there for strike one. Mm. Outside, that's Tries to shave the corner with that pitch, but it's one and one. Zero. Keeping it down here as it's to one and two. Boy, he's been great in this one. He's only one strike away from putting another zero on the scoreboard. So they do get their first hit, but they're... Digging in once again, A.J. Pollock. Leading off. Not Four sure if this doctor. is a powerhouse pitching right performance field. by both teams AJ. or bad hitting, but as we're moving All late right. into this one, it's about Come time on. somebody put something together to try Let's to score guys. a run. Benintendi has it, and it's a quick out number one. One gone now the in the L.A. 7th, and the catcher Austin okay. Barnes will dig into bed Barnes. next. And he takes ball one. 
That's a really tough pitch to do anything with. The backdoor slider just off the plate, just missing the strike zone. Uh, That's nearly an unhittable man. pitch to hit for a hitter. Chris Sale is just a beast. Is there two gone? Digging in, the Max batter. Muncy looking to put the ball in Second play here. Third. He went down on strikes yeah. in his first at bat. Swinging a ball line down in the left field corner, but this will be foul. Hit in the air out to center field. Waiting on it is Benintendi. He makes the play, and that'll end Come the on, inning. Guys. Striding in for Boston, Rafael Devers. He got called out on strikes his last time through. Yeah, Maddie, and hopefully he got it out of his system. Yep. Especially now, he's got a bear down. He gets the two strikes in this spot, has to put the ball in play. And it's fouled away. The next 0-2. Ripped down the line. And a reach to his backhand, but he can't come up with it. And the leadoff man's aboard. So a runner at first now with nobody out. And that'll bring up the shortstop and one of the better two-strike hitters in baseball, Xander Bogarts. No balls in one strike. Right over the top with that curveball, and it's 0-2. There's another pitch for a strike, and this guy's really attacking hitters well tonight. Being aggressive early on, and if he continues to throw strikes go. like he is, he's going to have a pretty good match. The first base Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Fastball taken, but that gets the zone for a strike. No runs, two hits, and two Boston errors to this point in the contest. Ready for pitches. Into the windup with the 0-2. Hit sharply on the ground. On the first, and this will remain a tie ball game as the inning is over. Okay, let's go David Freeze. David Freeze is up off the bench as he will pinch hit here in the bottom of the eighth in a tie ball game. David Freeze. There we go, David. And Freeze will reach safely. It's a base hit. So it's a leadoff base hit to open their half of the eight. Ready for another shot now. Okay. Justin Turner. Who could really it. use a knock here. Okay. Over three in the game so far. Turner. Sales sets. First pitch on its way. And a ball 1 and 0. Oh. 1 and 1 the count. Go ahead runs the board here at first with nobody out. There we go. And that's in there. Base hit. There we go. So it's first and second now. Nobody out. And in to hit next, it'll be the ever versatile Chris Taylor. Let's get one in the gap. He set. Here it comes. There we go. Left center. But this will be pulled out there in left center. Well hit, but a rough out number one. Oh, I'm safe. But he gets back in time, safe at second base. Holy cow, I thought it was tough. So it's a tight That's spot here. Stop. First and second. Oh, oh one my man gosh, out. I thought that was a big I thought that was a draw. Here's the first pitch to him. There we go. That's what we want. Third baseman's head, a fair ball. He pulls in the third safely as a run is also in, and with it, they take the lead. Tyler Thornburg is giving the ball here to try to work out of a tough situation. Two runners in scoring position to deal with. Pin me up.
from the stretch. Here's the pitch. Ran it in. Oh, this is no. bounced towards short. And now they've got the runner caught in the hot box as he thought about going home. The tag, and yeah. they got him coming back to third. That that sucked. Sucked. Again, that that it sucked. was a fly out for him in oh, his last trip. Good. Looking to keep this a one run game, the pitch. Yank on the ground down the line. Come set the 0-1. Oh, and here's a drive. Well hit out the Come on, Kike. Ben Intendi oh, retreats man. to the track, and he'll put this one away. So a... Okay, Kenley, let's go. Kenley Jansen takes the ball now in inning oh, number nine, looking to close the door. with the 0-1. That's taken. Now it's 0-2. Now a swing and a ball ground into second. Muncy gloves it. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. Into the box. Yeah, Mitch that's... Moreland. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Moreland. And he goes uh... against the shift there as this is on the ground to the left side. Moreland around first on his way for two. Mm. Come on now. So striding in, Andrew Benintendi, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. In there, strike one. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Muncie comes up with it. Throw on to first, and now the Red Sox are okay, down to their final out. So stepping in, Dustin Pedroia, as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. A sold-out crowd, 56,000 strong at the start, all up in L.A. Not a bad pitch there with two strikes, but it misses one and two. And there we go. Game one. Game is over as they get the possible tie all right. over the Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. So first Hit the like button been if you like this World video. Series and guys, what have we learned? Uh, follow or well, subscribe. In terms of what shape this series we'll is going to take, time. that really rides on the game.